Is there something going there on? There is something weekend? going on. I'm not In sure. fact, as you uh, check it out, we are now only 17 hours and 31 minutes away from the clash in KC between the Colts and Chiefs. Yeah, there's something really big going right, on. Right. Tonight's at 11 o'clock. Our own Dave Calabro and Amory Tiernan joined us live from KC, and they're already dealing with that snow that <laughs> Angela was just talking about. Did I see you making some snow angels <laughs> earlier, Dave, before we came to you? I saw you sliding and skating well, and having I, a good I may time. have. <laughs> Yeah, I was throwing snowballs at hers. Yeah, welcome live to Arrowhead Stadium. The snow, as you mentioned, has arrived expecting two to four, maybe five inches of snow. And uh, snow plows are out. Anne's loving being out in the weather. I just can't believe that we set up this shot so there's just like blowing right into our face. It's just well, we had to get this dramatic scene behind us here for the big game tomorrow. Hey, we've been seeing lots of Colts fans who made the road trip safely they got here. Well, they did. A, a lot of people were traveling today. The ones that got out of Indianapolis around 6 o'clock this morning made it here this afternoon yeah. really without any problems. But the people that left in the afternoon or after work, they really did hit some issues where they were going 80 miles an hour, then they were going 60 miles an hour, then they were going 40 miles an hour. Yeah. We did meet with some of the fans tonight as they kind of, everyone was coming in and talking about their travel stories. The people who were able to fly, well, you know, they everything was just dandy for them. <laughs> everyone else who came on the roadways, they had, you know, a story. And then also the realization that a lot of people that had said that they were going to make the road trip were now making other plans because heading out on Saturday really doesn't seem like a good option. The weather, it, it might prevent a few of our fans from coming because it's supposed to be 12 to 14 inches in St. Louis, but a lot of us are already here. We are so excited to be here. We're going to be loud and proud. There's going to be a large amount of blue out there in Arrowhead Stadium, and we're going to let the Chiefs know that we are here, and we're going to take it to them. Tomorrow will be my 333rd Colts game. 49 of those have been on the road. Yeah. So, over the years. Yeah. We yeah. love out of town yeah, games. Very, very They're the most fun. I mean, not like the home games are not fun. They're our hometown. They're our big deal. But the out of town, out of town games is where we get to celebrate our hometown and carry it on and, and give the message to other people that we are Colts fans and we love it and we love Indy. <laughs> They certainly love Indianapolis, yeah. and you know, it's amazing, 333 Colts games. I mean, the fans that we were talking to tonight, you know, they are not the bandwagon fans. Oh, yeah. They are the ones that are diehards, that have stories that date back to, you know, the Hoosier Dome and the RCA Dome and, you know, the team first coming here, and uh, the Colts are here. Yeah, here's a video of the Colts arriving uh, about 3.30 this afternoon. They're staying in Overland Park about 30 miles away from here, so they're going to have a fun ride tomorrow. So we'll be here uh, later on in sports. We're going to talk to Tony Dungy as well as we send it back in the studio. All right. What are you going to do with that You've snowball? You've got a five-second warning nervous. to run. <laughs> I'm out of here. Back to you guys <laughs> in the studio. We'll talk to you later and have much more Tony Dungy and his predictions yeah. on the big uh, game. Come play on, nice. Be careful. Play nice. Play nice. All play right. Nice. Thanks, Dave. We'll see you in a little bit. <laughs> and back here in Indianapolis tonight, we're all invited to a worship and watch party to help cheer on the Colts this weekend. In fact, Pastor Corey Duncan visited the show Community Connection on 1310 AM The Light today. City of Hope Community Church teamed up with the radio station to celebrate tomorrow's big game. And for every Colts touchdown, there will be a donation made towards a college tour scholarship for high school students. Um, we just wanted to create a fun, family, uh, friendly atmosphere for people to be able to come and watch the game. Everybody's going to watch the game, Colts are in the playoff. And so we wanted to create an environment where the community could come out and just fellowship together. Uh, refreshments there. Um, now the playoff and praise watch uh, party begins at 4.30 so, uh, tomorrow at the City of Hope Church on East 56th Street. That's right near German Church Road. All right, remember Colts fans, Channel 13 is your home for comprehensive coverage. We'll get you all ready for tomorrow's game with our Clash in KC special. That begins at 2.30 tomorrow afternoon. We'll take you on the field, take you outside the stadium, even tailgating, so you see all of the atmosphere, all leading up to football night in America right here on Channel 13.